Hi guys, welcome to Algorithms Made Easy. Today we will go through the day 20 problem from the July Lead Coding Challenge. Remove linked list elements. Please like the video and if you are new, don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you never miss any update. We need to remove all the elements from a linked list of integers that have a given value. For example, given we need to remove all the elements with value 6. This question is about learning the basic delete operation in a linked list. If an element to be removed is in the middle, it is generally easy. We would need to remove the link between the node and its previous node and point the next of previous to the next of node that is to be deleted. But what if the node to be deleted is the head node? In this case, we do not have a previous pointer. In such cases, we can create a dummy head node that will act as a previous pointer. This dummy node or a pseudo head is also called as a sentinel. Now we can eliminate the link between the dummy node and node 3 and update the next of sentinel to point to a correct node, here node 4. We then return the next of sentinel node as the head node while returning the result. Let's take this linked list as an example and try to delete the node with value 3. First and foremost, we will need a sentinel node. We can give it any value. Here, let's give it a value as 0. We will also point its next to the head of the input linked list. Our updated linked list will look like this. Now, we will take two pointers. One to track the previous node and the other to track the current node. Initially, the previous will be at the sentinel node and the current will be at the actual head of the list. We will now iterate over the list till the node at the current pointer is not null. And while iterating, we will see if the node is the one to be deleted. As here it is, we will delete the current node by updating the pointers. We will update the next of its predecessor to point to the next of the current node. We will also move the current to the next node. We will again do the same as the current node value is equal to the value that needs to be deleted. So we update the pointer of previous node and move our current pointer. As this is also the node that needs to be deleted, once more we do the same. Here we see a node that we want to keep. So we move our previous and current pointers one step ahead and again check if the node needs to be deleted or not. As it does not, we again move both the pointers one step ahead. Now that the current node becomes null, the loop breaks and we have this linked list remaining with us. As we need to get rid of the dummy node or the sentinel node, we return the next of sentinel as the head of our output linked list. So this becomes our final output. Let's revisit what we did. We initialize sentinel node as list node 0 and set it to be the new head. Then we initialize two pointers, current and previous, to track the current node and its predecessor. We then looped while current is not equal to null and compared the value of current node with the value to be deleted. If the values were equal, we deleted the current node. Otherwise, we set the previous to be equal to the current node. Then we move to the next node. At the end, we return the next of sentinel. This becomes our algorithm. The time complexity here is O of n as it is one pass algorithm. The space complexity is O of 1. Here's the actual code snippet from the method. You can also find the link to this code in the description below. Thanks for watching the video. If you like the video, please like, share and subscribe to the channel. Let me know in the comments what you think about the video.